<laughs> Hello. How is the family doing? Oh, they are doing well. Great, great, great. Junior is graduating next week. Beautiful, beautiful. Equia is now in the medical school. Great, great. Yes. And how about Jackson? Jackson was called to the bar last month. Wow. And madam? Because of the elections, my wife and the little ones are going to the US for a short stay. You know, family first. Safety first, too. This election cannot kill my family. You did the right thing. Those guys, they don't have work to do. So just find something small for them, use them, and after the election, you just forget about them. Look, I have more guys waiting. So if you need more, just let me know. You know what? Let me call you back. I'm in a short meeting. My honorable. Look, we'll get there. Like I was saying, guys, we have to win this election at all costs. Fight for fire. We have to face our opponents squarely and deal with them. Don't spare anybody. If you suspect that we are losing, create confusion. Big time confusion. We can't stand aloof and watch our opponents win. No. We have to win at all costs. And when we come to power, after the election, what else? No way. Your wife and your daughter are traveling out of the country tomorrow. Your daughter is in the medical school. Your sons are here and there. And you think we are fools? What do you take us for? Why are they not here with us? No way, guys. Never. Not this time. We won't allow you to use this for your selfish interest again. Yes. 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 No, no way. No way. We won't allow you. No way. Guys, see, let us say no to electoral and politically related violence. We should refuse to be used for this crime and save the nation because the nation needs us. And our family needs us. This message is brought to you by the National Commission for Civic Education, NCCE, with support from the One Ghana Movement. Yeah. Yeah.